Hello and welcome to Paul Sherry Conversion Vans, where we have over 50 new and pre-owned conversion vans in stock, ready for immediate delivery. Whether you're looking for seven passenger, nine passenger, even mobility conversion vans, we keep them in stock, ready for your immediate delivery. If you're on YouTube, hit that subscribe button so you can be assured to see all of our new arrivals, just like this one here today, as soon as they hit the lot. Also, for over 50 still pictures of this vehicle and a full description, please visit our website at sherryvans.com. That's S-H-E-R-R-Y-V-A-N-S.com. Today we're showing you a brand new arrival, a 2016 Chevrolet seven passenger Explorer conversion van. Guys, this is the limited SE, which is Explorer's top of the line conversion van, high top conversion van. So you're gonna get over five and a half feet of interior height while you're in the back of this vehicle which helps you when you're moving around into the vehicle, makes it a really nice feature. Starting off in the front, you're gonna notice we do have the upgraded front bumper, pet pack painted to match the exterior color, which is black exterior color. Power, or power LED fog lights located on the bottoms on the side. And you're also got this really nice center step up bar that serves as a license plate bracket also. You can simply step on that right there and it helps you clean that front windshield if needed. Really nice 20 inch rims right there, guys. Definitely gives it a good look. Medallion ground effects that run along the side here. And what those are is this section right here. And all, what it does is hide that step up bar located right there on the driver and passenger side. Privacy glass all the way around this vehicle. This vehicle also does come with a rear backup camera, which is located right here beside the license plate bracket. And you're also gonna have your backup sensors, which are these right here, located all the way across that upgraded rear bumper also. Trailer tow package right there with your seven pin hookup. Dual exhaust on this vehicle, as you can see there. And as you'll notice on this side, just like the driver's side, you do have the medallion ground effects that definitely hide the running boards. This is a seven passenger uh, conversion van, like I said which in the back of the vehicle, it's gonna give you one row of captain's chairs. And then right behind that, you are gonna have your three person bench seat back there that does lay flat. That is a power bench seat. By laying flat, it definitely gives you a nice area if you need to lay down and catch a snooze. In the rear of this vehicle on the outside, you do have your two outside surround sound speakers for inside of the vehicle. And the two small circles right inside that are gonna be for your rear AC seat and hair rear a seat and air system and then a small cubby hole built in the center for a pillow or some knickknacks starting at the top we do have the power rear sunroof as you can see there sky lighting throughout the side of this vehicle on the high top and you also have your led rope lighting built in the center cup holders all the way around this vehicle no matter where you're looking you have plenty of cup holders usb plugs same situation wherever you look you're going to find plenty of usb plugs definitely to plug in all your electronics and you also do have rear heat and AC vents located down on the floorboard also up top in the center we do have the infinity lighting located right here and we're also gonna have reading lights throughout this vehicle um, that can be turned on and off at each individual seat um, so that person sitting in that seat can have a reading light if needed this vehicle also does come with privacy shades simply pull down all the way around this vehicle if you need privacy inside the vehicle or you're just trying to keep the sun out from uh, from coming in the vehicle and making the back of this vehicle warm you can use them for those also just like in the rear of the van you do have the surround sound speakers located on the on the side of the TV here along with the extremely large nice um, not touchscreen flat screen Samsung TV in between the driver and passenger seat, we do have the center console located right here. You're going to have your game plug right here, 12 volt DC volt right there, HDMI plug, and also you can turn your speakers on and off located right there also. More USB plugs, your blue, the Blu-ray player located right down here on the bottom, and these little cubby holes right here for your remotes. Another thing that's nice with the center console, you do have these two cup holders located between the front driver and passenger seat. This also serves as a small cooler um, located right underneath there for uh, your beverages. Both this driver and passenger seat up here is gonna have heated seats, 
power lumbar, power recline, and power seats uh, for moving the pedestal on both the driver and passenger side. Starting up at the top, in between the driver and passenger seat, these controls right here is going to operate your rear heat and AC system. Um, they can be operated obviously by simply turning here. You can adjust it different than the front. Right here you're going to find your AC and heat system for the front of the vehicle. Um, that can be adjusted obviously different than the rear. Touch screen radio, built in navigation in this particular vehicle which makes it a really nice feature and a bunch of other cool built in features with there also. This vehicle does come with XM radio also that you can subscribe to, which makes it nice um, if you're looking for uh, a radio station without commercials, you can definitely subscribe to that and you can have it built into this radio. All the amenities that you would expect like any on any normal vehicle, you do have your cruise control located on the right hand side of the steering wheel here, your volume controls on the back, or your, I'm sorry, your cruise controls over here on the left, your volume controls on the back of the right, and then also right here in the center, you can, or these outside buttons right here, you can change your radio station from the steering wheel. And then right here in the center, you do have the option of using hands-free capability with this vehicle. You no longer have to reach for your cell phone while driving down the road. Simply just program your phone directly into this vehicle and you can simply answer your phone by simply hitting the phone button and carry on the conversation directly through the speaker system. Uh, 120 volt uh, plug-in AC plug located right here more usb plugs up here in the front and obviously your dc plug out here on the side and then there's also one here on your driver's side here's your tow haul feature button and plenty of more center uh, cup holders located for your front passengers right here upgraded center piece around the side here and also around the radio here that is a dipped plastic gives it a very nice look you're also going to notice that dipped plastic on all your door trims you also have all your LED lighting for the rear of the vehicle. All the buttons to operate them are located right here in the center. This vehicle does have home link built into it, located right here on the center also up top. Um, you can program up to three garage door openers into this vehicle. Makes it a nice feature. You no longer have to carry around your garage door openers while traveling down the road. Like I said guys, extremely nice vehicle, hard vehicle to find. 2016 Chevrolet Explore limited SE, every option you could want on this vehicle, only 16,000 miles on it. High roof, which is going to give you that extra interior height uh, for your back passengers. All the amenities you would need in a conversion van heated front seats, power front seats, navigation, power rear bench, which I'll show you how that works real quick. Which definitely uh, makes it a nice, convenient thing when traveling. Plenty of rear storage, as you can see here. And that rear bench can be operated just by these buttons right here. Simply hit the hit the down button and it will lay flat. And you can use that, like I said, to lay down and take a nap if you need be, or you can use it for storage. And also this rear bench, not only does it lay flat, it does, uh, it does go forward and backwards. So if you do need additional leg room for your back passengers, you can simply pull this seat back or forward as you can see there. All in all, an extremely nice vehicle. This van's located at Paul Sherry Conversion Vans. If you'd like to know more about this vehicle, please visit our website at sherryvans.com. There you're gonna find over 50 still pictures of it, a full description, and everything you're gonna need to know about this vehicle. That's S-H-E-R-R-Y-V-A-N-S.com. And if you're on YouTube, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can be assured you see all of our new arrivals, just like this one here today, as soon as they hit the lot. And for the guaranteed best price, on any conversion van, whether it's a seven passenger, nine passenger, or even mobility van, make sure you always shop Sherry Chrysler Dodge Jeep and Ram.